ambitious of all the enterprises of the Sherlock Holmes Society of London. Yeah. Yeah. The 25th of August 2001 is a date which has been preying on my mind for some considerable period of time now, about three years I should think it probably is. Uh, I hope it is a, a, a date that will not go down in infamy as, a day, <laughs> as opposed to a day that will be long remembered with great affection. <laughs> but uh, as you all know, um, fairly shortly we shall be embarking for Harwich uh, and then across the seas to the Baltic uh, for a host of very interesting, I think, events uh, there for the course of, over the course of the next couple of weeks. There are a couple of things I need to say. There are no formal speeches today, but a couple of things that need to be said. And the first is to um, welcome the Deputy Lord Mayor of Westminster, who is with us, and the Deputy Lady Mayoress, who is standing over there. We are extremely grateful to them for gracing this occasion and being a part of our send-off. Thank you very much indeed, sir. Thing <laughs> 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 that needs to be said is that there are some omens which need to be investigated here. The first is that I have seen a lady in a swimming costume. <laughs> <laughs> I can assure you this ship is well and truly tried and tested. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I know the chairman of our tour operator is called Mr. Wade, but that is, uh, that is no reason to be in the slightest bit anxious. But uh, it, it is also very important that, uh, talking of liquid matters, we at this stage raise our glasses to the success of the enterprise and so I give you, the game is afloat. Yeah. 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 The game is afloat. <laughs> and now I'd like to introduce Mr. David Wade, um, whose name I've already taken in vain. 
who is also going to welcome you on behalf of Arena Holidays Limited. <laughs> I think the deputy law a glass of champagne <laughs> gets us in a sort of merry mood for the rest of the weekend. I'm particularly pleased that we've been invited here today because I understand that there have been some very close relationships with this society over the last few years, and that is why I'm delighted that I can come here today to support you on your golden anniversary. I say you are being driven up here today. Lisa said, well, what are you going to say to these people? And I said, I'm going to tell them my Sherlock Holmes joke. <laughs> so, so, which she said, no, 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 no. so which she said, no, you're not. <laughs> I, I look around and I see some fantastic costumes here. You've obviously brought the good weather with you. And the one thing I have to say to those that are all dressed up is you must know how I feel going around in the hot weather because it's absolutely baking here today. So well done for actually buttoning up today. <laughs> Your golden anniversary is something that I think you can be proud of. And I hope you really enjoy your cruise. You're going all over the place, Norway, Denmark, Sweden, Finland, Russia, Estonia, Germany. So please send the regards of Westminster to everywhere you go. And can I wish you a bon voyage? Thank you very much. Um, I've got one or two things to say, some of which are just housekeeping matters. If another, another very, very important announcement regards baggage. Now, I have seen how many cases you have brought, <laughs> and it worries me <clears throat> that clearly you are going to need to do something with those cases, because you will not want to trip over all of those cases in your cabin for the entire two weeks. Hello. 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 How lovely to see you. Charles Augustus yes. Milverton. <laughs> I say, Any secrets? I say you're, Any filling, you're filling show up very well on camera. <laughs> and welcome to the trip.
Maybe you're in Mufti now. <laughs> so nobody would recognise me. <laughs> I haven't seen him. smiling face. Is it all right? Yeah, you're you do what you like. So I just want to get the uh
in the rest. Somebody throw him a banana! <laughs> he looks like a fish. He looks like a wily coyote trying to get the rocks to fall. Oh. Oh, See, the niece said that Father Christmas over there with a sack on his back, the only authorized sign. There. You see that triangle? Is it like a road sign? Sign, that's the father, that's the Christmas shop. This is the Christmas shop and next door is the post office where you can get your postcard stamped as if it was from Father Christmas. Years come next Sunday. And Big Ben. They haven't removed that and neither have they removed the decorations of the Grand Hotel. And also the Nobel Peace Prize laureate stays there. See, the, have a look at the vases in front of them. It's because we are so close to the University of Oslo and um, 
And the buildings on are going to have a general election on September the 10th. And this yellow building is the eldest part of the university. That's where I was trained. They only train lawyers there these days, law students. We have a new university center. All right, good. And the Royal Palace is right in front of us. We can't drive up there, but everyone can walk up there and touch the building if they like. This is... And this is... Yes. And you see that new extension? That's the bit that the sunshine hill skiing till you see the sign Holmacol. You see the Holmacol sign and the five Olympic rings? That's where the takeoff is. The theaters are sitting on the concrete seat on both sides, and I have brought up a, a, a photo here for you. So I'll show you what friend of your queen mums. And he was a very keen skier, and the name of the statue is the joy of skiing. Yeah. If you look down, you can get to the top. There's the cemetery down. There. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah. Very off. And you can see the jack off here. But then they fly in the air, 132.5 meters, an extra 25 yards to jump. Because you can see the dots over there. We are next to it, you know. This is just one meter in between the dots. In the summer we have a concert, then you see the platform there with the Oslo Philharmonic Orchestra. And then we drink. So here we are, the City Hall in Oslo having just been up to the ski, sl uh, ski jump. Thank you.
Well, I'm, you know, I always fade into the background. Stay with it, looks like. Any bedings for the 